Howdy, this is Marissa with Marissa Moments. So the download is this. Let's talk about vampires. Yeah, let's talk about vampires. What Spirit is telling me is that we operate under the assumption that once we invite someone, something in, we must always have them, right? But, but at the same time, we can acknowledge that in order for them to come in, we have to have had invited them. It's a whole conundrum, right? However, what Spirit is saying is that you need to think about these things like the vampires of true blood or whatever other show might be out there. Because yes, you invite them in. You invite it in, whatever it is. However, you can also resend that invitation scoot them right back out because what spirit is saying and showing me is that our programming tells us that once we have some sort of toxic or traumatic commitment or tie we feel obligated to follow through on that we feel obligated to chain ourselves that is why we call it a ball and chain right we feel obligated to chain ourselves to whether it be a person, place, or thing. Now, this does not um, specifically go towards marriage or relationships. This could be friendships. This could be employment. This could be family. This could be friends. This could be anything, right? Only you would know that. However, what Spirit wants to remind you of is that you are under no obligation to remain in a situation or circumstance that belittles you or shrinks your divinity. Now, again, we're not talking about true responsibilities. Now, mind you that I put emphasis on the word true because there are true responsibilities that exist. However, we tend to have the propensity to make everything a true obligation when it is not. So stop reading into your programming and start reading into yourself, into your divine center, into your intuitive guidance system that tells you yay or nay, and then follow through because whatever decision you make will be the best one for your higher self and even for the other person, place, or thing involved. And that street goes both ways. So you choose. <laughs>